everyone, welcome back to another awesome stream with your stream. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, sorry, it kind of started a little bit later, but you know, that's just how it is, but uh, I'm not sure if the music is a little bit too loud or not. I don't know. <clears throat> okay, so I just recently got this because I figured that everyone wants to play games with each other, right? You know what I mean? But anyways, um, so I bought this game, um, where it comes with multiple games inside of it, which, it, one of them is Quiplash 2, I have the first one, which you guys played with me last time, um, but it also comes with this, the other games which everyone can participate in as well, like Trivia Murder Party, Gespionage. I have no idea what that is, I've never played any, any of the other ones except for Quiplash. Baking it. Something like that. And KO. This one actually looks like really funny because you actually get to draw whatever design you want on your computer and every one part is Ooh, this design is better and all that kind of stuff. So, if you guys want to pick which one you guys want to play, by all means, please do. Is that, is that any better? I can't really tell. Well, how about we start, um... How about we start, let's see... Everyone gives an answer, but not everyone knows the question. One of your friends has something to hide. Find the faker before it's too late. Ooh, this actually looks pretty fun. How about we play this then? <laughs> All right, guys. Like last time, if you guys don't know how it works, you go to Jackbox.tv. I'm gonna go in on the fun as well. And basically, you just type in the code in the Jackbox TV, and you can join in on the fun. So you better join in while you, you guys can, because, you know, that shit gets really full. Uh, hold on, Jackbox TV, okay. There we go, we got some people. Oh shit, guys, slow down! I have ah, what? I I didn't even get the chance to get on. Hold on, I'm gonna be the audience. I'm gonna be in the audience then. <sighs> Unfortunately, because you know you guys are too fast for me. Uh. There we go. I got it. Welcome to Fakin' It. I'm Cookie. I'll be your spirit guide through all this party game self-embarrassment. Couple quick words before we jump into the game. And yes, it's skippable if you're one of those people. During each round of play, each of you is going to be sent a task to your device. Like, raise your hand if you've ever farted. But one of you will get nothing. And that person is the faker. Everyone wants to figure out who the faker is, and the faker just wants to blend in. When you hear the ghost sound, you either raise your hand or not, depending on whether you've ever farted before, which you have. And the faker just has to fake it. After that, everyone votes on their device who they think the faker is. If everyone picks the correct person, the faker is caught. But here's the most important part. Fakers, if you're caught in a lie, if you raise your hand when you really should have kept it down, lie, cheat, deny, come up with whatever story you have to to throw other players off the scent. Be the faker. Some of the tasks will involve raising your hand or pointing, 
or maybe making a weird face. But there will always be a faker, and you'll have three chances to catch him. Oh, one more quick suggestion before we get going. It's important to be able to see each other, so if possible, consider sitting in a semicircle or like small lines facing each other. Unfortunately, Whatever that's works not best gonna be while the case still feeling comfortable. Because, uh, how we're not in the same room, unfortunately. So. Let's start with Hands of Truth. It's an easy one, just like we saw a minute ago. Everyone's gonna get a task that involves raising your hand. Okay, sending the task to your devices now. I, I think I just chose a really bad game to play because literally you can't participate in this one. <laughs> right. <clears throat> The task was, raise your hand if you've continued eating some food after finding a hair in it. Vote for who you think is probably the faker. You can change your vote if you change your mind, by the way. This should be interesting. I don't know. I guess we can play like a couple of rounds of this before we move on to the next game because the faker can only be caught kinda... if the vote is unanimous. Well, so know. do your best I to come to a group you consensus. Press whatever. You get two more chances to catch that faker. Hand. I don't know. Sending your second hands of truth task to your devices now. Ask, raise your hand if you've seen Game of Thrones. I haven't, that's for sure. Vote for who you suspect is the faker. Yeah, that's what I kind of figured as well, that this game is meant to be played in person, but... That faker is still on the loose. I don't know. This is your last chance to catch the faker. I guess we're going to have to, like, guess. Sending oh, out wait, your third guess. hands of truth task now. <laughs> I have no idea. Guys, just pretend that we're all in one room. Because, you know, that, you know, because that's the thing, I guess. The task was, raise your hand if you have hairy arms. Vote for the faker now. <laughs> That's kind of funny. Too bad, you couldn't get it together for that last vote.
Just your hand if you continue eating some food after finding it here in it. It's category picking time. You will have Use your device yeah, to choose which do. type of tasks you'll all be subjected to. If Edie or Dark Holzer would like to leave a link to my Discord. Well, we I can't wait forever, so I'll right just now, pick something. It's to going to be... Right now, so... you guys want to do number that, pressure. Do that for him? Everyone's He's going to get a task that you know, involves holding there, up yeah. a number of fingers, probably from 1 to 10. Okay, sending the task to your devices now. This was the task. Hold up as many fingers as colleges you've attended. Vote for who you think seems like the faker. By the way, silence helps the faker, so don't forget to get everyone talking. For some reason, I don't know why, but for some reason the links, whenever someone puts a link in the chat room, the whole the text thing comes freaking big and stuff. Which is kind of weird. I don't know. I need to fix that. Probably the HTML um, or the CSS coding. I, I probably need to fix that. I don't know. You couldn't quite figure out who the faker was. You get two more chances to catch that faker. Sending out your second number pressure task to your devices now. task was, hold up as many fingers that your longest fart ever lasted in seconds. <laughs> in seconds. Okay. Alright, vote for who you think the faker is. Yeah, that, I mean, you could do that, but I feel like that's an extra a hassle or an extra step you don't need to because you there's a chat room right there and you have to just you're already here so you know why why bother but then you would have to have two windows open at the same time which i you would think would be kind of a hassle i don't know you didn't find the faker and you didn't really learn anything definitive one last chance to catch the faker Sending out your third number pressure task now. Yeah, yeah, I, I yeah. After this, we're probably gonna play the T-shirt one because that one's really fun. From what it looks like, I don't know. And the task was, hold up the number of fingers you think Homer Simpson has. Pretty sure that's four. Vote for no. the faker now. Because, would it, no, I don't know if Homer Simpson has four fingers or five. I think he does have five. Yeah. Pretty sure he has five fingers. I don't know.
and everyone voted for... You found the faker. At the last possible moment. Yeah, only because he told us. It's not cool, man. You're not supposed to do that. I'm just kidding. I don't care. What category do we want to do next? Use your device to pick which type of task you'll all do together. Just want to leave it to chance, huh? Okay. Hands of Truth. Everyone's going to get a task that involves raising your hand. Okay, sending the task to your device's next. Uh, let's try something else because you can't really participate in this one as much. So everyone get your phones ready in order to participate because I, I know that there's a lot of people on this <clears throat> this stream right now so everyone wants to play. Hold on. Uh, let's play the TKO because that one's really fun. Phone's ready. I guess you get to choose your own character. Possibly. You also get to choose your own quote when you win. KO. I am the tournament master. My likes include t-shirts and fighting. My dislikes include seafood, negativity, and mind games. Life is too short. I brought you all here to T-Shirt Island because one of you is a murderer. Just kidding, it's to make t-shirts. Every epic tale starts somewhere. Yours begins here, at the training grounds. You will use your device to draw three drawings. You may draw whatever you wish. And if your wish is to know what to draw, hit the suggestion button. Begin your first drawing now. Ooh, we get to draw. Nice.
P.O. Box announcement. Um, it should be this week. I'm pretty sure this week I'm gonna set up my P.O. Box so you can guys can send me stuff. <clears throat> so, yeah, I get hyped for that, I guess. I don't know. And that way, I can Time is not for decoration. Finish quickly! All your letters and stuff. Which I'm probably gonna hang if you give Drummy a picture or something like that. I'm probably gonna hang it on your that decent enough, but a bit traditional. Uh, this time, try changing your shirt color with the little tabs at the bottom. Begin drawing two. Huh, draw an another thing. Okay, sure. Probably not anytime soon. My room is kind of a mess, so I'd, I'd rather not, you know what I mean. Is it MySpace dead though? I don't know. I heard it's dead. Like, no one really uses it. Anymore. I'm about to expire. Like you may want to finish up. Which is kind of pointless. I don't know what's going on with that. No idea. One drawing to go. Let your freak flag fly, man. Begin. Only seconds remain. Yeah, I mean, yeah, dude, if you want to play, yeah, um, hmm, think about yes, that. I that think we can work with these. It's really iffy because you're going to have to be fast with your For your last exercise, your you will write as many slogans or phrases as you play. can. But I don't know. The kind of things you might see I on, oh, these games, I don't like, know, shuffled, a t-shirt. Um, like, the and don't let and hubris consume you. Currently. Use a suggestion if you need one. Go! Well, I know that's not your best material. Write another!
Make haste before time runs out. All right then. That that went really fast. I had no time to think of something good. Your training is at an end. Now take note of your device. Select one drawing and one slogan to create the perfect t-shirt combination. And I do mean <laughs> perfect. Oh wow, guys. These drawings are lit. Nicely done! I can wait no longer! Let the tournament begin! Gauntlet 1 Versus Fight! Fight by submitting your votes and your devices, <laughs> that is. Daddy J. Wow. I wonder who wrote that one. A new challenger appears. Battle. <laughs> the free hug one, that's pretty funny. Versus Fight each other! Oh, the irony. Because they don't have any eyes. I don't know, dude. Appears. Engage one another in violence! 9-11 <laughs> was staged, yeah, that sounds like someone who would, who would say that. <laughs> Versus? Oh, that's sad. The what? Norwell? Only I was left. Oh, yeah. Yay, I won that one. Awesome. Yeah. Versus? <laughs> Where's my waifu? Get the umbrella. Don't worry, you we should be able to join next time. Ooh, that's a really good gift to do that. Fight for me, baby. Fight. Burn everything. This game is, works really well if you have like a tablet or something, because then you can take one of those stylus pens and draw on it. 
Oh, damn, dude, it got obliterated. Winners. Time for a training break. Use your devices to enter one new drawing and as many new slogans as you wish. Hey, try not to screw this up, okay? Go! Oh, this should be fun. Only seconds remain. Now right. Hmm. I'm not really sure about slogans, but let's see. That time is not for decoration. Finish quickly. The second gauntlet looms, and the hairy paws of Kismet have shuffled your drawings and slogans. Design your new shirt now! Time is about to expire, you may want to finish up. Gauntlet 2. Oh look, it's Versus Shadow. Is it dog? I'm too gay for this. Go ahead and fight already! <laughs> Mom said I was a faggot. I like how it's smiling and stuff. Pretty funny. Oh. <laughs> Versus. 
horses? <laughs> Gotta go past. Oh my god, that is great. I love that. I should make a shirt out of that. That'd be so funny. Versus Engage in an altercation The fifth element I saw that movie before and that was actually a pretty good movie if you guys haven't seen it It's really good I think that's supposed to be a super sound person I don't know. <laughs> Yeah, the, I gotta go fast Teacher, it's really funny a new challenger appears. I want you to fight. I won't cut it. The defender wins. Ah, oh, man, come on, guys. A new challenger appears. Attack! Get back a new something. I can't read that. Keyboard. I don't know what that means. Versus Attack! Oh wow, that's that's really good. Whoever did that is really good. Oh, that, that one's pretty good as well. Jeez, those two are really good freaking drawings. Winners! <laughs> I like the dick butt one. That's really funny. Brace yourselves for the final gauntlet where the toughest oh shirts God. from the previous rounds go toe to toe. Prepare to vote. Versus. Break. I mean, uh, fight. Fight! 
The defending shirt always wins ties. Deal with it, man. Oh. Versus. Battle. I kind of saw that coming. Of course, it's like fucking great. <laughs> it's great. We have a champion. The spirits of yeah, T-shirt Island have been satisfied. And believe me, they're real jerks when they get cranky, so thanks a ton. Guys, if you want to join, now's your chance. Slots, guys, come on. Looks like you have uh, some people are getting ready to join, so let's see. I am the Tournament Master, and according to the ancient gem on my wrist, I've walked 1,400 steps today. I beckoned you here to T-Shirt Island for one reason and one reason only. To engage in deadly T-Shirt battle and maybe play some foosball if there's time. Okay, that's two reasons. Draw something good this time. Begin.
This should be pretty interesting, I wonder... Seconds, people. You know, I just realized that some of these characters that you see on the screen is based off like Japanese folklore. Make haste before time like runs that out. One, the second person is to grab it in between the lines and stuff like that. It's like a kappa. You guys don't know. It's like a. <laughs> Uh, Excellent. Can, this time, show me something, something different. Remember know, to use the suggestion button if you need an idea. Drawing like to begin. Probably have to look it up on the internet, something like that. I don't know. Better hurry up, I love mints and quicksilver. Yeah, like 30 seconds. Time goes short, hurry up and finish already! Last drawing, let's get weird with it. Begin. I like the minimalistic look of the game. By the way, if this is a little too much drawing for you, you may want to try the quick training mode in the game settings. Only seconds remain! I love to watch two masters at work. Next, the slogans. Try not to be too boring. Go! I'm looking for like three or four from each mm, of you. Does that seem doable? Just give it a shot. Well, 
20 seconds. That timer's not for decoration. Finish quickly. Yeah, you really dug deep that time. All right, make your shirts now. Time is about to expire. You may want to finish up. Well done. Buckle up, everyone. Let the tournament begin. Gauntlet 1. Oh, this should be pretty cool. Huh. <laughs> wow. Is that Versus? not can? Fight. Using your devices to float. Is that Pikachu smoking or something? I don't know what that is. Pika... Pika bitch or something like that. Trek is love, Trek is life. Yep. Versus... Fight! What the hell is that? Is that white hair or something? A new challenger appears. Five. Ooh, I like the Google like the I need my wife one. That was really cool. Versus Fight <laughs> Wow, it's just a box Or is that supposed to be Colorado or something? I don't know, it looks like it A new challenger appears. Battle. That looks pretty interesting. I never said, is that a cat or something? I don't know, that looks like it's from a show. Versus Fight. <laughs> that, that was pretty funny. It reminds me of freaking John Lennon with his circle glasses and stuff.
Winners! I think we could all use a training break. Use your devices to enter one new drawing and as many new slogans as you wish. Don't let me down. Go! Alright, it's like really hot right now, so I'm gonna get something to drink while you guys enjoy your little fun for a sec. I'm, I'm just gonna mute my mic. That timer is not for decoration. Finish quickly. Begin writing. Alright, I'm back guys. <clears throat> that was kind of refreshing. Drink a nice cold water. Make haste before time runs out. Forge a new t-shirt champion. Good luck! Gauntlet 2 Jay is Bay. Versus? That's right, guys. Of course I am. Fight for me, baby. <laughs> Spark you me as I'm Mass, I don't know what that means. <laughs> Versus Fart. Wow, guys. Really? Challenger appears. 
Why? <laughs> that's kind of funny because it's accurate. I think that's um, Shrank's wife or something like that. A new challenger appears. In case one another in brackets. Yeah, that's pretty good. Nice stick figure, too. I mean, that's supposed to be that red glowing ass thing. I mean, I don't know. The tie goes to the defender. Oh damn, didn't expect that. Versus. Attack. <laughs> Thick. Indeed. Challenger appears. Go ahead and fight. Oh, that's pretty already. cool. <laughs> Suck my eyelid. That reminds me of that one show called Monster Hunter or something like that. I don't know. It's a really old show that came on like on Fox Box or something like that. It's not Monster Hunter, it's called something else. I don't, I don't know. It was like a cheap knockoff of Pokemon or something. <laughs> Winners! So it's come to this, the final gauntlet. Only the strongest shirts from the previous rounds will compete, and only one will come out alive. Versus... Fight! A go-to shirt for date night. Look out, ladies. Nice job, guys. Very well done. Let's play a different game. Actually. Let me try all of them. Well, I don't know if I have time to try all of them, but let me try the other ones. Trivia Murder. Be the last to survive a serial killer's absurd trivia game show, but it's fun. Ooh, this is like one of those awesome games. I kind of want to try that.
Well, this one's pretty creepy, so, you know, I should play this on Halloween, because that would be pretty cool. I'm actually going to try to join this time. Looks like everyone's good to go. Oh yeah, because you know, grinding meat is always creepy, right? That should be a thing, like Wake Halloween in July. Up. That'd be pretty cool. Welcome to Trivia Night! A trial by fire to wash clean the unworthy. But with like a fun party game twist. Need a mosquito, huh? I'm going to ask you a bunch of trivia questions. If you get a question wrong, you have to fight for your life. In one of my super fun mini games. If you do badly in the mini game, I'll kill you. But don't worry, ghosts can still win the game. When one player is left alive, we'll go you to know, the final round where the living and dead compete to see who really, can escape really first. Dark, that would be really oh, and hey, cool. look, we've got an I audience playing puppets along puppets too. Tell you what, at the end of the one. game, if the audience has less money than the player who wins, like everyone in the audience dies. Like I don't know. Evil is just live backwards. That's pretty deep if you think about it. Like Doing presentations make me I'm nervous, it, but I got through it. Bad. My public speaking teacher, Mr. Temmy, would be so proud. Now let's play. Okay now, first question. Now for a question about my favorite supplier of fishing waders. What does the LL stand for in LL Bean? I'm not kidding. Use your device to answer the question. That means you weirdos in the audience, too. Time to rain out. And the correct answer is... Who got it right? of you, let's play a game. Welcome to the Killing Floor. Oh, that's is pretty intense. Killing Floor. We're going to play the finger cutting game. Fingers <laughs> are overrated, finger right? Finger cutting game. Just choose one of your fingers to cut off. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Ready, set, slice. <laughs> wow, these are gonna make a great necklace. Let's take a look at the scoreboard, shall we? Do you like it? I took an online C++ course. Aced it. Oh, and let's pay attention to the audience for a moment. They get lonely. And like an audience at most improv shows, you're just kind of there. Let's try another one. The second largest consumer of Guinness beer after the United Kingdom is what country? God, dude, I don't know any of these stuff. Jesus Christ. The second largest consumer of Guinness beer. I'm just going to go the oh, You know what? It could be Nigeria, because I heard that they drink a lot of beer. So that might be it. I don't know. 
And the correct answer is... This one. Dude, I so called it. Oh my god. But you know what? I cut my middle finger <laughs> off. Everyone that was wrong. a choice for me, so... Let's play a game. I was pretty much fucked. Welcome back to the killing floor. Dude, imagine if this was a real game. I would have been I'm going to ask you now. a question. Answer That's pretty very sad. carefully. That says a lot. Yeah, I What's thought it was smell? Ireland as well. Type an answer on your device and press send when you're finished. What's that smell? I don't get it. What What's that supposed to be? I can't smell anything. Come on! Less righty righty and more sendy sendy. Answering was not optional. You know, it really makes me angry when your refusal to participate reveals certain inherent flaws in my basic game design, so please, yeah, don't do that. Welcome back to the scoreboard. The scoreboard is your friend. All right, next question. In what year was the Model T car first manufactured? Ooh, this is something about Tesla. You know what? It's not about Tesla. It's something else. Who said? Pretty sure it's 1908. This. Oh my God! I so called it again. I'm so pissed. The rest of you who are still alive, prepare for your punishment. It's time for some wordplay. Use letters to spell the longest word you can before time runs out. It'll be good to get your fingerprints on some of these letters too. I'm going to hurt the person with the shortest word. Do it now. This is really intense. The letters don't have to touch each other, and remember to press submit when you're done. something. Let's see what you came up with. Nope. Bad spelling. If you die, you die. Oh, snap. We all died. Jesus Christ, dude. And boom. You're a ghost. But don't worry, ghosts love trivia party games, so you're still in this. You haven't lost or anything. I mean, I was a ghost for a while, but I got better. Only one player left, huh? Well, the end game is not quite ready, so let's do this. If you can survive the next two questions, I think the final round should finally be ready to go. It's worth the wait. Trust me. I've got more questions for you. What race usually takes place in the last weekend in May? What race last weekend in May? I'm gonna go in good old Indianapolis. That's probably why. And the correct answer is... This. Oh, snap, I got it right. Let's go someplace fun. You know you love it. It's math. 
Answer as many math questions as you can before time runs out. If you can't get at least 15 right, you die. Let's get this math party started! Remember to show your work. I don't know what that means, but it's fun to say. I don't see any time or anything. I wish we could do math all day, but time's almost up. Oh, that sucks. Terrible tragedy. I'd steer clear of that old abandoned indoor skydiving facility if I were you. Rumor has it, some awful things happened there. A horror-themed trivia game show, <laughs> but the questions much weren't all about died. horror stuff. That's pretty Honestly, funny. it sounds confusing. Let's play again, because this one's actually really fun. Welcome to Trivia Night, a phantasm of mind-rending challenges. Yeah, who needs rules? Let's get on with it. First question. What are the five consonants in one vowel that contestants receive for the bonus round puzzle on Wheel of Fortune? Okay, so... Five con... One of vowel... Okay. I've never seen that show before, so I have no idea what this is. What are the five constants and one vowel that Time for okay. now! Damn dude. I don't know. Probably got that wrong. And the correct answer is... Who got the question right? Oh dude, I got it right. Sweet. Oh, it's just a lucky guess. The rest of you, prepare for your punishment. We're going to play chalices. I've given all the safe players a bit of poison to use. Pick a chalice Ooh. to poison. I get to pick poison. Nice. Okie dokie, it's your turn to play. Pick a chalice to drink from. I like saying the word chalice. Makes me feel like someone who wears silk underwear. Ooh. Look, I get it. I was nervous the first time I drank poison too. But pick a chalice. Yummy, yummy. Now let's see what everyone drank. But let's not forget that not drinking is also a punishable offense. Now let's see where that poison is. Shh. Embrace the light, my sweet dove. 
Everyone died, basically. Oh, damn, that's pretty tough. I wish tough. I had the rights to play a Belle Biv DeVoe song right now, but I don't. Let's take a look at the scores. Now, don't get upset if you're in last place. Just do your best and know that you are special. But also, I will kill you, so do better. And before I forget, let's check in with that audience. Well, 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 looking good, audience. How about this? Who is Nikki Santoro beaten with bats and buried alive with in a cornfield at the end of the movie Casino? I'm pretty sure it's his uncle, I don't know. Time's running out! I'm gonna go with the brother. Who picked this one? Oh my god, I'm so lucky. Holy shit. The rest of you who are still oh alive, my god. come with me. Dude, I have the dumbest luck right now. It's crazy. Well, howdy there! Welcome back to the killing floor! Yeah, good luck with that, guys. Let's get artistic up in here! Your life depends on your doodle. Moral ambiguity. Draw this thing the best you can and press send when you're finished. Hello, Aggie. Um, put one on my Facebook. I'm not sure what you're talking about. Hurry up. <laughs> now everyone gets to vote. I want you to pick the worst drawing. Pick the drawing that makes you go bad. I'm bad pretty sure everyone's gonna Look pick at what a. you did. No. Go with your gut. Pick the worst drawing. The votes are in. Yep, I knew it. Oh wait, hold it's on. It's time to punish the artist. I think I'm going to bury that terrible drawing with you. Here's where everybody's at right now. I'm surprised I've even, I'm even alive. Like, Jesus Christ, dude. Next question. Hey, seriously. What in the hell is polenta? I have a feeling that it's eggplant mush or something. Time's running out. I don't know. Who said this? You're in for a treat. Let's test your memory. Everyone gets to play this time. Memorize the pattern. <laughs> oh crap, I have to memorize the pattern. Okay. Alright, let's put these away. Shit. From left to right, what was the order of the weapons? If any of those other players do better than you, I will be very unhappy. Yeah. 
If you can't remember by now, you're probably screwed. <laughs> This was the pattern. How close did you get? But did anyone totally show you up with their own memory? Now that's what I'm talking about. Oh, Jesus Christ. Are you kidding me? You think you know who your friends are, and then they viciously attack you in a trivia game. Same old story. Here's another one. I only read Tiger Beat magazine, but tell me. Who was Sports Illustrated Sports Person of the Year for 2015? Tom Brady. Wow. That was my first guess, actually. I have a surprise for you! Well, you're not very lucky. Prove it by spinning the loser wheel! Come on! <laughs> round and round she goes. Where she stops, nobody knows. And the loser wheel has chosen. <laughs> Only one of you is still alive. You know what that means. It wasn't easy making it here alive, and it won't be easy to escape with your body. I'm going to give you a category. Seven Wonders of the Ancient World. Tap on each answer that fits, then press Submit. Let's see the right answers! You move Pretty forward sure it's one it's space the Grand for every Canyon hard answer. Getting real close to the exit. Oh, did I mention that all the other ghosts get to play too? If the ghost catches up to you, then they will steal your body. Then they can escape and win the game. Here's everyone's next question. And ghosts get a third choice to help them catch up to you. actually pretty easy. A 
bunch of smart people, huh? Hurry up! Ernest Films. Ernest Films. I have no idea. is right on your tail. Watch out! Subatomic particles. Okay, it's on. I have no idea what it means by subatomic particles. It's grav graviton. I don't know. Oh, nice, dude. Way to go. You actually survived it. I like how it says no one cares. That's kind of funny. Alright guys, so I'm gonna stop right there because I'm freaking tired as hell right now and I kind of want to go to sleep because I don't know why I'm freaking tired. Uh, I just am. So, yeah, if you guys, um, oh yeah, by the way, there's gonna be a new thing, um, Wednesday, if you guys haven't seen my video on the whole Discord thing, you should check it out right now. Um, it's on my YouTube channel somewhere. <clears throat> but I'm gonna be doing a podcast. So, if you guys want to join the podcast, go feel free to, to, to do so and yeah we're just gonna be talking about all kinds of stuff it's gonna be fun or if you just want to watch sure that, that's fine too but yeah pretty much that's pretty much it for announcements um yeah and other than that i was saturday two new videos like always so he threw me and now he
Hope you guys yeah. enjoyed the stream. It, it was pretty fun, even though I didn't really say a lot. Because, you know, this is more of, you know, you interact with other people instead. You know, Dark, I can kind of see. Yeah, I mean, if you want to send some fan art, go ahead. By all means, I'd love to see it. Me. Yeah, um, We're all I don't know what else to say out. besides that, but yeah, everyone. Yeah, good night, guys. Have fun. Hope you guys had fun. Yeah, pretty much it. It's a trivia murder party. Yeah, don't forget to join my Discord. You can get to know. Um, there, I did make a video about my Discord, so if you guys want to join and have There's no talk with people, and make running. friends and stuff, there's that. You probably won't I'm probably going to wait till the whole maybe thing is over. I don't know. Get out of here oh, thanks. Dark Balls has donated $2 to me. Thank you very much. I really appreciate it. It really means a lot, man. Drags me onto the killing floor. Well, there's nowhere out. Yeah, enjoy the little ending the... thing at right now. And there's Nothing a pack of ghosts that's right behind. That was a pretty intense game, I gotta say. I really like this game. It's a trivia murder party. Although I, I wish it was kind of more gory though, because that would actually you be pretty cool. Carefully, but I realize that it's a family game, even though people are cast for type like the vulgarities and stuff like that, or make vulgarity um, pictures. All non pretty fun, yeah. Huh. Special thanks to your audience for dying. Yeah. Special thanks to you guys for dying for us for a good cause, I am I'm assuming. I don't know. It's a trivia murder party. Isn't that like the worst way to go? The cause of death because you made bad art. There's no point in your running. You probably won't Killed by a bad spin. But maybe if your luck holds out, I died by not the best memory. Not immune to poison. Allergic to poison. Well, obviously, poison is gonna kill you either way. That's what it's called poison for. Congrats to Cody, bro, for winning the game. He's actually survived the whole thing, which is kind of weird because the last time we played, everyone pretty much died. But you know, good job, dude. But yeah, I'm just going to end it right here. Like I, like I said before, thanks for coming, guys, and hope to see you on Wednesday from 8.30ish to 9.30ish to 10. I don't know. Depends. But yeah, see ya.